Hi, I'm Leah Ravalado from the Food Allergy Institute. I'm excited that you're going to be joining us on this virtual summit. I want to share my story. It's one that's probably not uncommon or unheard of from a lot of you. I was living a life that looked perfect from the outside. If you looked at my Facebook stream or, well, at the time Instagram wasn't around, but if I had Instagram, it looked beautiful. It was perfectly curated. You can see my gorgeous husband, at least I think so, my beautiful young children who all look happy and together and I looked thin and you know I had a great career. I was vice president of marketing for a financial firm. So I had this great successful career that I worked really hard to get to. Everything looked great, but what you didn't see on Instagram or Facebook is that I was burnt out. I was incredibly stressed out and I didn't know where to go for help. My young son at the time was living with eight life-threatening food allergies. He was also allergic to penicillin and latex and animals, and all of these allergies would lead to anaphylaxis, which I had witnessed personally repeatedly. And then I also had a toddler who was new to our family. We were a family made of adoption, which was just such a gift. And I was struggling. I didn't know how to take care of my children. I didn't know how to live with the crushing stress and anxiety that comes with living with a child with chronic illness. I didn't know how to do it. I looked for help. I looked at doctors and psychologists and life coaches. No one could tell me what to do. So I figured it out. And I want to share those secrets to my success. What I did to turn my life around. What I did to turn my family's life around. So that when you see those pictures of me and my family on Instagram, we truly are living our best lives. So I'm no longer sitting on the floor of my kitchen stressed out. I am not crying at the kitchen sink. I am not constantly worried and stressed. I was living from coffee to wine, you know, when it was socially acceptable, but I was not living my best life. I was probably living my worst life. And I wanna share with you how I went from that stressed out, burned out mom, all looking beautiful on the outside to now, living a full, happy, well-adjusted life with happy, happy kids. And you can do it too. And I want you to come along with me so I can share with you how I did it, how I faced my adversity, and how I can help you live your best life too. I hope you join us. I look forward to meeting you, virtually of course.